So you learn a lot in class, but you don't always see where it's applied. When you do research, you actually get to use what you learn and apply it to real world problems that can save the environment or save some lives. The overall goal of our research is to create a metal organic framework, or MOF, that can capture carbon dioxide efficiently and reversibly so that we can release it back into whatever situation we want to put it back into. I think we're years away from actual practice because of how small scale our uh, reactions are because we're using a lot of different metal organic frameworks to try and do this. So it's kind of a quantity approach than trying to get a quality product out of it because we're trying to find which one is the most promising first. Our modifications to the framework, it would create a charge gradient along the, uh, the kind of struts of the jungle gym structure. And that charge gradient would induce the charge on the carbon dioxide and the carbon dioxide would line up against the pores. And that helps us because the problem that metal organic frameworks have been facing is that carbon dioxide and nitrogen have the same diameter for their mass size. So with a Zwitter ionic functionality, it will hopefully capture more carbon dioxide while letting nitrogen gas go through. If it's successful, it can be very useful because any factories that emit flue gas, they're emitting a lot of carbon dioxide. I think it will definitely be able to capture carbon dioxide. I'm not sure about the efficiency yet because we don't have any uh, real studies as to the true efficiency of it, but I believe it will be able to capture it with enough efficiency that we can showcase it and do more research. Really, I wanted to get into materials research, and this was the kind of research I really wanted to be in, was in research where I'd be working with materials, synthesizing new materials, and creating something that will help better the world. I haven't really liked taking so much time off and doing nothing with my time. I like to be productive. I want to try to make a difference in the world somehow. And Clarkson offers a very good environment to do research and then you even have some free time during the weekends to go explore the Adirondacks. It's just an overall nice environment.